it ain't about how hard you hit. It's about how hard you can get hit and keep moving forward. Who was the greatest? Who was the best of all time? If two athletes from different eras could actually compete against one another, who would come out on top? In one corner, the reigning champion at Mason the Line Dixon. He'll be pitted against the former two-time heavyweight champion, Rocky Balboa. Computer says Rocky Balboa would be triumphant. I think well, there's still some stuff in the basement. What basement? In here. I think I want to, like, fight. You know, nothing big, small stuff, like, locally. What are you trying to prove, Pop? I thought you might want to get involved. Don't you think you're too, you know, old? I think your brain's losing altitude. <laughs> You heard Rocky Balboa applied for a license. You want me to fight a guy that I can beat with both hands tied behind my back? That computer fight got a lot of people curious. Yeah, but I ain't interested in getting, like, mangled and embarrassed. People are gonna think you're going crazy. What's crazy about standing toe-to-toe -to -toe saying, I am? If this is something that you gotta do, then you do it. Fighters fight. To beat this guy, you need speed. You don't have it. You've got calcium deposits on most of your joints, so sparring is out. I had that problem. So what we'll be calling on is blunt force trauma. Heavy duty punches that will rattle his ancestors. Yeah. Let's start building some hurting bombs. Yeah, yeah, we play, we play. What's up, hockey? The press is labeled you a Balboasaurus. <laughs> How do you feel about that? It's a fight. It's a fight. Head bust, head bust. We gon' hit him with the left. Larry, why is this billed as an exhibition? So they wouldn't have to call it an execution. It's a fight. Head bust, head bust. It's a fight. It takes guts climbing back in that ring, knowing you're gonna take a beating. You can tell them over until it's over. Where's that from? The 80s? That's probably in the 70s. 